Hi, Lorraine Menza here, and in this video blog, I'm going to address team leadership and building in internet marketing. What is your role? What is your guidance factor? What should you be doing as a team leader in internet marketing? Well, the first thing, there is no hand-holding. You have to develop the entrepreneurial mindset. I mean, this is their business. So, yes, you're there for them, but not in the role that they may think you need to be. You're not pulling them up. They have to pull themselves up. So see, when I give you these suggestions, you'll see what I'm talking about. When you first have a, a new team member that comes on your team, you either call them or give them an email and welcome to your team and introduce yourself. Maybe through a video, you know, however you want to do that. And then you want to set, give them certain uh, criteria that they need to to work on being a new team member. They may have a startup type of thing in your company, so a startup video, so you want them to look at that. You, um, If you have a blogging system and they ha and that's part of, of their, you know, what they're in, and they have tutorials, you need to direct them to do those things. If you have a Facebook page for your team members, encourage them to get on there, to write any questions that they may have, and encourage and also any team member can answer those questions you can answer them but your other team members but you're working as a team there is no I in team so remember that as you're as you're helping uh, and you're directing basically you're just kinda like the director so uh, if you're gonna have any videos like maybe you have some videos that you think are really good for beginners put that in the file section of your fan page or your page for your team and then in your email you encourage your new team members to go look over look at those videos if they're on your email list they are probably getting your blog so they have an idea how to blog and what you're doing the point is there is no hand holding there is no I in team there is a, a work ethic a kind of thing that you can figure it out and uh, if they have to invest, like if a team member comes up to you and says, how do I team build? Well, if you have a product in your back office that teaches them how to team build, you say, hey, you know what? You need to purchase this product. We'll answer all your questions. And that's how I learned, you know, or whatever. And that's what you need to do. So with that said, I just want to encourage all you guys not to... You know, if you're spending your time every day hand-holding each and every one of your members, you're not going to be building up very big because you're not teaching them how to do that. And they got to learn how to do that. So with that said, hopefully you found value. Click like, share, subscribe, and leave a comment below. And um, I will see you. Oh, click on the link below. Take care. Thank you.